when the CD first came along, um, it was Guns N' Roses had just come out with User Illusions, and that's when the long box came out. And I, before User Illusions came out, I remember having a conversation with my manager going, well, it's just a waste of cardboard. Why don't we just shrink it down to the size of the thing? He goes, oh, the record company's not gonna invest any money in doing that, because everybody was doing the long jackets at that point, or the long boxes. And lo and behold, they did come out and shrink-wrapped and all that. But that was the big sh shift as far as the packaging was concerned, was a CD, and you know, I mean, the CD was cool, it's smaller, and it's just sort of, uh, it's it's just progress, you know. It's it's the, everything's got to be more convenient, take up less space. You know, I mean, it was much simpler to slip in a CD than it is to put the needle on the turntable, blah 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 blah. So it's a natural evolution, I guess. But that's the beginning of the huge sort of transition to where we are at now.